Hey y'all, welcome to Sweet Tea and Butterflies. Today is going to be a short video. Um, I made a couple, um, like last month I think it was, I made a set of butterfly coasters. Well, I decided, I got an idea to make a holder for them. So that's what we're doing here. It's going to be kind of a short video. Um, I used the Waverly White um, chalk paint, the Lavender Sachet, and then of course I used Mod Podge. I didn't um, include all the painting of everything. Oh, and I used the antique wax too on the, the roof of the little um, house thing. So I didn't include all the painting and I had to do the iron on method off camera. But I had taken, painted the front white and the rest of it in the lavender sachet. Um, added the Mod Podge on the white section on the front and then let it dry completely. Then I took it over um, and used my iron to apply the napkin using the iron on method. Um, I kind of had a mishap. Um, I, as you see here, I'm putting the Mod Podge on uh, the front and I kind of had a mishap and had to start all over again, but the process was the same either way. So I really, I got this pack of napkins at a paint at the painted tree in Franklin and I've actually, I've done a couple of, um, videos with a couple of projects with it um i really uh, really like it i think it's such a pretty pattern on there so once everything dried i took a nail file and just filed around the edges to get the napkin um the excess napkin off and to make sure that there was a nice clean edge there you can see um, <clears throat> oh pardon me <clears throat> I just want to take a uh, this uh, moment to thank all of you who subscribe to our channel um, it means the world to us and for any of you that are watching that aren't subscribed, I invite you to please subscribe. Um, when I hit a thousand likes, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. And here shortly, I'll talk a little bit more about that giveaway. This, um, the, the top portion of this is kind of scalloped. So, it was a little bit more uh, challenging to get in there and get all of that off. And not to mention, my file is like really worn out. As you can see, it's busted in half. It's <laughs> um, it's seen better days for sure. So I'm struggling to try to get in all those little crevices there. And I probably shouldn't have left all the filing in here. It was going to be a really short video if I cut too much out of it. It's already short, so <laughs> um, trying to find the balance between showing certain things and not having like got off long videos. So bear with me. It's growing pains. I'll get there for sure. I did not realize that it was this much. <laughs> so sorry, y'all. So sorry. Well, 
I've got a couple more of these little boxes that, um, or, well, plants or things, what, whatever you want to call them. I've got a couple more of them that I'm going to have to figure out some cute ideas for. But anyway, back to the, the giveaway. When I reach a thousand subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway. And in the little video here, you can see um, there's like a ton of craft supplies that I inherited. So I'm going to share the wealth. Um, and I'll be giving away some of those craft supplies. So I absolutely love it. If y'all would subscribe, share, comment, like, pushes my, um, videos, uh, in, you know, the algorithm pushes my videos out to more, uh, viewers. So, um, we would love it if you would do that. Um, so here I'm just doing a simple twine bow. I wrapped it around my fingers a couple of times, cut it off, and then um, cut another piece and just tied it in the middle and cinched it down real tight. So I have a stray there and it popped out of there. It's okay. This is just a cute, simple little project. We're also on, um, I wanted to invite you to also join us on social media. Follow us on social media. Uh, we are on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and TikTok. So, we'd love for you to follow us on those. We also have our own little um, craft group chat thing on our website. Um, I'll have all the links in the description box. To make it easy if you wish to go follow us on our other social media platforms. I would love if you'd um, leave in the comments some of the stuff you'd like to see us create. It would be, I'm always looking for ideas and as you can see from that craft haul, I've got plenty of craft supplies. Uh, I mean, my stash before I inherited that one was monstrous. So we would love to hear in, uh, for you to leave in the comments some of the things that you would like to see us create. I'm trying to get the, the tails to my bow to lay where I wanted them to. But here we have it and got little the little coasters in there and voila how about that that was pretty quick pretty simple just a little bit of painting a tiny bit of decoupaging and a twine bow we thank you so much for all your support and thanks for watching